Hello everyone, welcome back and uh, this is Naveen and if you are new to this channel and please do subscribe and show your support and uh, yeah, last video we have actually discussed about uh, string util, right? Let's take uh, same setup, okay, same program and uh, I mean same application where I'm going to use uh, one more uh, uh, custom, custom module, okay? So here what I do is in the same util, I create another file, uh, for example, new TypeScript, let's say math util, okay, some math util, okay, so let's make export class math util. So in this, what I uh, am going to do is uh, a simple uh, math table, for example, in childhood we have, uh, we might have learned, right, 5 into 1 is equal to 5, like that, so that kind of math table uh, I'm going to print using this function. Okay, let's see. So I just create a function or method. It's a class, right? So public static mm, print math table. Okay, so simple function. Uh, so this will take a parameter. You must have to give some uh, some value or some number or okay, just say number or just say value of type number. And this returns you uh, obviously string. Okay, so what it does is it will take uh, some value. It means it it can be uh, fifth five table, five math table, six math table, like hundred also in any number you can give. Okay, so here let uh, temp string of type string is equal just empty. So I write for let i of type uh, number is equal to I start from 1 into 5 into 1 to 5 into 10. Okay, so i less than or equal to 10 up to 10 I want. Okay, and i plus plus you want you can 20 also you can make but I'm just making 10 up to so 5 into 1 5 into 2 like that. Uh, so what I do is temporary string uh, plus is equal to first what you do you will print uh, 5 into 1 so 5 means my value okay so value into 1 1 is my i is equal to uh, its result what is that value into i and some slash n that's all and return temporary string okay so 5 into 1 is equal to 5 into 1 is 5 like that so we are done with the function very simple and let's call it where you call uh, somewhere in this method uh, let's say math util i say let the number the number of type number is equal to 5 Okay, I'm, I'm going to make 5 math table. So, let result. Uh, the problem is let result I can't take because result already declared here. Uh, I just give a same name uh, without let. I can reuse the same variable or else, uh, yeah, let's use the same variable. I already have a result. So, result is equal to, result is equal to um, what I do math util I have to import it so let's say import um, import uh, math uh, util and just say math util dot print math table of the number that's all so math table gives me the uh, natural math table by taking my number gives me returns uh, number I mean sorry returns a string and that string I'm appending to assign to result and that result same variable I'm using here that's all let me check back here click on send see you get the 5 math table 5 into 1 5 into 2 like that okay uh, you want to try something other number you can just say 15 15 so go save it and make sure your server up and running uh, yeah go check send it say 15 150 okay so if you want to make not just 10 you want to make it uh, 20 uh, go to here just make this as 
20 or you can take that value also here okay dynamically that also possible so fine now go check run the program up to 20 it is printed okay that's, uh, that's fine okay so here what we have understand is how to create our own module because uh, generally what happens if you want to create a backend application uh, like users module and admin module even in the coming applications also we're gonna create it okay so we need to have a basic idea how gonna create okay that's why we are we are doing all the level by level okay so and once we have done with this and we can uh, start with the the slight complex applications level by level okay so that's all i guess enough for this uh, uh, custom module story and let's meet in the next video for uh, routing of node.js okay so thank you so much and please subscribe to my channel and show your support thank you